All right, so today I'm going to start taking off this end plate right here. And the <clears throat> best way to do this, I think, is with the sawzall. I'm just going to slice down all the way through the end of it. And this is where the bus bar connected to um, these aluminum plates on the back that connect all these batteries in, uh, in parallel and then series. So I'm going to start slicing that off and see what we can get that taken care of and get that end plate off. And as you can see, that's what happens when you touch one thing to something you shouldn't touch, you get sparks. All right, so in my last video, I started to try cutting off the uh, end bus bar, had a massive spark. Started looking into it, and here's what I, what I found. Um, I ended up uh, shorting that top piece of aluminum with the one right underneath it, which it's really hard to see, but that is a, a completely separate uh, block of cells. So the uh, Sawzall, blade guard basically ended up shorting those two together. Um, so what I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do uh, is I'm just gonna duct tape that edge while I'm cutting off the bus bar ends here. So hopefully we don't get any more sparks. Yeah, so as you can see right here, um, I was able to cut through that pretty easily. And uh, you can even start seeing some of the cells poking through there definitely have better access to the cells once I get all these bus bars cut out of here. All right, success. We now have opened up this entire end. So now you can see all of the beautiful 21700 cells we got in here. Um, no more sparking, no more damage. Uh, so this is gonna make it a lot easier now. For we My next step I really wanna start to try to do is get all of these uh, aluminum plates taken off the back. And, you know, I'm still not sure how to go about that. Part of me thinks I can just grab a hold of it and just rip it and they'll come off pretty easily. Um, but it, there's a really good chance I could uh, short one section to another because a lot of this loose aluminum flopping around could, I mean, this is the gap between one uh, brick of cells and the other. And if you short between here and here, for instance, if you just touch across that, you're going to get a spark. You're going to get a spark here, spark here, spark here. There's just too many places in here you're going to spark. Um, if you're not extremely careful when you take these apart. So I'm going to give that some thought, figure out the best way to get these apart without uh, sparking. <laughs> 